Today, you guys, we're going to talk about glutes, and I'm going to show you some of the workouts I've been doing to enhance my glutes. I am in prep for my first bikini competition, and I seriously need to build my glutes up, as you can see. So one of the workouts I did recently was pop squats on a speed ladder. As you can also see, I have a resistance band around my thighs for the extra burn. And I've taken it a step farther and used a 10 pound weight. So I'm going to do this going back and forward and I'm gonna do that for three sets. So with that pop squat, I am working my hamstrings, my glutes, my calves even. Then I'm working my abductors. Uh, with the band and and with the weight it puts the extra force so it's a great workout all around here I'm going to do some resistance band jumps I'm going to explode up and you can really see my calves working here same thing hamstrings are working glutes all of that with this workout it's just a more simplified version of the squat jump I'm going to go down as far as I can, having a wide stance, controlling the motion, making sure I squeeze my glutes at the top, which is so important, flexing those muscles as I am finishing that movement. Here, I'm going to do a curtsy squat or a curtsy lunge, back lunge with the bar now you can do this with weight but i suggest doing a set without weight just so that you can get your form together because just because you're strong it doesn't mean that you have good form and that your stability is together so it's best to just start off as low as you can and then work your way up but again that's going to be working your hamstrings your quads and your glutes area I always tell people it's better to do things slow and right than fast and wrong. So take your time when you're doing this. I did 10 on each leg and did three sets of this one as well. On this workout, I added a little bit of weight, but you don't have to. So it's just a deadlift. A full deadlift with a lunge added in so when you bring it up to the top you're going to do your walking lunge remember that whenever you're doing your lunges you want to make sure that your knee is not going over your toe I always tell people that when you're lunging just sit down into the lunge like you would a squat Bring your knee down as far as you possibly can without it touching the floor. And then you just go ahead and pop it right back up. And this one is, is pretty difficult. As you can see, I'm struggling a little bit. But you just push it up and squat once you have it, lunge when you have it uh, pushed up. So we're, I mean, this is working the uh, upper body and lower body as well. You're getting a shoulder press in there. So this is a good full body workout. You're gonna do about 10 of these. And of course do it for three sets. Watch your form at the end. As you can see, my form was getting a little bit sloppy towards the end. And that's why I suggest you start off with no weight, just the bar. And as you can see, you know, I have a lot to work on, but if I do this workout consistently, you know, obviously there's going to be rewards to it. You want to make sure that you're doing everything safely. Make sure you know why you're doing what you're doing. Don't just copy. And hopefully you'll get some good results soon.